If your man's got shot and your wife was having a baby, who are you gonna go see? You all, this is another video to show you that these males do not like their wives. They prefer their own boys. They prefer somebody else other than their wives. A question was asked in street interview to probably random guys on the street and be like, okay, if your wife is in labor, she's about to have your baby, and your own boy got shot, who are you going to meet? Let me read it for you also watch to the end so you can hear their response and I'll be back to share my thoughts at the end of the video. If your man's got shot and your wife was having a baby, who are you going to go see? My homeboy. First of all, to my wife, she will understand that my homeboy is my like my brother. If he's shot, that's almost like a death in the family. Yes, I celebrate my life with my child, but she understands that like if my homeboy about to die, that's somewhere I need to be too. And my child, listen, I know my homeboy. My homeboy will take care of my child if I die. I'm going to have to go see my wife, bro. That's my kid. I can't miss those type of moments. No funny. It's like, I never had a father. So it's like, I'm not going to do that to my child because then they can use that shit against me. My wife can use that against me. That might not even be my man no more. So you never know. And if he got shot, that means he is some shit he shouldn't be in. If my homeboy a real nigga, he'll understand I'm going to have to be there for my kid. I can see him after. I mean, if he die, he die. Rest in peace of soul. But as a real nigga, he know I got to be there for my kid. Because I hope he would do the same shit if I got shot. If he would have came to me and his wife having a baby, I would have told his ass, get the fuck out of here. Man, fuck that bitch. She going to have a baby regardless. I'm going to go see my man before he dies. I'm going to go see my man. I'm going to go see my man because my wife having, getting pregnant. So, I mean, that's, she's creating life. I got to mention my man because he don't die. Listen, if your wife was pregnant and about to give birth in a hospital, and your man's got shot, who are you gonna go see? My plug. You gonna Give me see? some gas. You, <laughs> you gonna go see your plug? Yeah, go see my plug, get some gas. Then I can deal with whatever situation I got there. So you're not gonna be worried about your wife pregnant or your man? She already pregnant and she already in the hospital. I mean, he gonna be probably in the hospital too. But you still gotta go see the plug regardless. Yeah, I gotta get the gas first, you know. Okay. This video kind of reminded me of a particular street interview video as well, whereby this um, guy was asking men and was like, who comes first? Your, your wife, your mom, or your daughter, or your child, or whatever. You all. You all. <laughs> almost in fact all the videos i saw all the videos i personally saw nobody picked a wife everybody was saying oh my daughter oh, my mom oh, my mom oh they're my wife the wife was always the last the mom is it that the mom is the first or the daughter is the first or the second daughter and, mo and mom were sharing the position but you see that wife nobody's dragging the wife with the position the wife remains the least, the less important person in their lives. So when I saw this video, fast when I saw the when I saw the video and I saw the question, I was wondering, okay, surprise me, you all. Even the one that said he has to be there for his wife, he said he's going to be there for his child, which is which is nice. At least he's trying to be a good father, but then he's. He's just been there for the child, not just for the wife. It was like, my wife is going to come for me. Da, da, da. He, he found that the wife was come for him. That's his own fear. But he wants to be there for his child. But see the rest? They don't, they don't give. Like, <laughs> they don't give two spoons about how their wife is feeling. So far, their own boys are good. They are good. I just have a response to share with you all. Let me go ahead and read for you all to watch to the end and I'll be back to share my thoughts at the end of the video. If your wife was pregnant and about to give birth in a hospital and your man's got shot, who are you gonna go see? My plug. You can give me some gas. You, <laughs> you gonna go see your plug? Yeah, go see my plug, get some gas. Then I can deal with whatever. These be the same men that go around every single day um, talking about uh where where did the love go um women aren't marriage minded um 
I don't I I don't treat 304s like wives and all that type of stuff whole time. He's openly saying that if he got a if he if, if his wife was giving birth to a, to his child, he would go see his plug so he can get some gas. And don't think for one second that he was playing. I don't I don't buy for one second that he's not serious like most certainly he would do that. That's not even the craziest thing that I've heard men do while their wives were giving birth. If your man's got shot and your wife was having a baby, who are you going to go see? My homeboy. First of all, to my wife, she will understand that my homeboy is my like my brother. If he's shot, that almost like a death in the family. Yes, I celebrate my life with my child, but she understands that like, if my homeboy about to die, that's somewhere I need to be too. And my child... Listen, I know my homeboy. My homeboy will take care of my child. So the 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 common theme here is th that their wives come second to a lot of things, right? The the birth of their children comes second to a lot of things. That's like her thing. And I just got off of a live with dudes who were talking about how um, they don't want to be stepfathers because they desire their own families. But most men are they're we're just selfish. Like, you don't really want those kids so that you can be there for them, right? And I know you, I know people are, oh, this, you don't read too much in it. No, but, but most men are, they're not showing up. They're not showing up. And this is just another example of that. I just, I, I made a video earlier about um, B Ballerina Farms and the husband wasn't there when um, the woman, Hannah, was giving birth to one of their children or two of their children. He was like packing meat for their business. Like, men will find any reason to not be there for the birth of their children. There is no way you're going to convince me that if you're not willing to be there for the birth of your child, that you're going to then show up for the child throughout the duration of the, you know, the development of the child. Like, it doesn't make any sense. Y'all don't really y'all don't really like babies. Y'all don't really like kids and you don't like your wives. Right. These dudes don't have wives, but, you know, the wives that they hope to get one day, they don't like them. <laughs> They're telling the women straight up and down. Yeah, I don't really care. I'm going to I'm going to go get my gas from my plug or I'm going to go see my homie. But and he and 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 he should understand. Uh, I mean, I'm sorry. She should understand that that my homie comes first or whatever the case may be like be fucking for real. I know I've said it before that I hardly hear when a man will say I don't like my wife. I hate my wife. I don't hear that word. I don't hear that sentence like them saying it out loud like I hate my wife. I she, I don't like I hate her I don't really hear them say but you see actions you see other things that they say they prioritize you can tell that they don't like their wives and most of the time if you and I ask them like that kind of deep question some of them might be truthful to tell you eh, actually I used to like her until she started nagging but most of the time you will never hear them say that word out loud like I don't like my wife like just just like the videos, you didn't see them say, oh, I don't really like my wife that much. I prefer my own, but no, they won't say that. They will tell you, my, it's my G, it's my brother, my brother. <laughs> I have to be there for my brother. My wife can take care of herself. Like, in fact, in fact, if it was not the first child, most of them don't even, they don't even care about childbirth. Most fathers, right? They are only, most of the time that the father are always there when he wants to give birth. It's the first child. You see, when you're going through labor back to back, a woman, you had the first one, the second one, the third one. When it comes to the second, third, especially third, fourth, most of the time, women are the only ones alone. And probably family members, maybe from our side, not even from the husband's side, that will be there for her. Because they assume that you've been there, you know how it is. So why should I be all? Oh. See, most of the time when the men are there is because of your, you, he's the first child and they just want to like, you know. <laughs> but most of, most of the time, they don't really care about all these things. And you wonder, they are the ones that want family. They are the ones that want, <clears throat> when a woman says, I don't want to get married or I want to start four B movements, they are the ones that are angry, agitated. A woman said, I want to stay child free. I don't want to have kids for this man because they don't appreciate. They don't even value your life to start with. They are angry and like, you don't want the legacy to continue. You are selfish. 
who will hear something like this and want to get pregnant or have babies for this kind of men? Me, I won't share. <laughs> Because I saw this video also made me remember a video that a lady was saying that she got pregnant or she fell in love with guys like this, right? But she still stayed in the relationship for a very long time till a guy went to jail. If they don't, they are not even in the situation and they are thinking like this. I just imagine if they are in the situation. I just feel like this is another video to just show you that these men don't like their wives. They won't say it, but the way they behave, the, the things they choose, the emotions, everything, you can tell that other people are up here, especially their own boys, but their wife down there. And I wonder, why can't they just marry their own boys? Because the way they prioritize their own boys, you guys, especially the ones that have, like, serious friends because there are some men that don't really keep friends but the ones that really keep friends have they has friends here and there they hold on to their own boys huh? and it's the same kind of men that will tell women not to have friends but then they cannot do without their own boys they are always so close to their own boys you can see they can't do anything <laughs> for their own boys even putting ah uh, what is your take on today's video? Let me know your thoughts down in the comment section. I just saw this video that I shared with you all today. Let me know your thoughts down in the comment section respectfully. And thank you all so much for tuning in in today's video. Don't forget to like and share and subscribe. And be sure on post notification bell to get notified once I upload another interesting video. And I'll see you all in my next video. Bye.